Hello everyone, welcome to Best Recipes with Sharon. Once again, we're going to be doing a great recipe that is nice and easy. It's called Roasted Potato Wedges. This one's made with rosemary, garlic, and butter, and loaded with lots of cheese and toppings. Okay, so go ahead and preheat your oven to 400 degrees to get started. Let's get started in making the potato wedges. So you'll wash and trim up your potatoes. I've seen a red potato today, but you can use whatever potato you have on hand. If you're using a medium-sized potato like this, you can cut them in four. But if it's a little bit larger potato, you may have to cut it in more wedges and use less of them per muffin cup. And once you've placed the wedges upright in the muffin tin, you add a lump of butter in the middle. And give it a generous sprinkling of salt and pepper. Now you could add the rest of your ingredients right now and just slap them in the oven for the whole time. But I like to get them started just as they are right now. And I leave them in the oven for about 20 minutes. And while they're in the oven for that time, I shred some marble cheese. So then in about 20 or 25 minutes, I remove them from the oven. And then I work quickly while they're still nice and hot. You don't want them to cool down too much. And I add some bacon bits and a little bit of minced garlic and top each of them off with some shredded marble cheese. And you don't really need to worry about how messy it is. If the cheese falls off a little bit onto the sides, it'll just crisp up and you'll be able to peel that off and eat that as a snack as well. And I let that cheese melt a little bit, so I leave it in the oven for about another 20 minutes or so. And then I pull it out quickly, put some rosemary and garlic herbs over the top of it. And I add a little bit more cheese because the cheese has already melted a little and I like lots of cheese. So I add more. And now I'd like to give a shout out to Larry for making up this special rosemary and garlic herb blend. And once you've added a little bit more cheese, then pop it back into the oven for a good 20 minutes or more or until the potatoes are nice and tender when pierced with a fork or a knife. Then once they appear to be nice and tender, I just finish them off by broiling them on the top rack in the oven, just for a few minutes. I like to make sure that the cheese has browned a little bit, so I just like that last touch. And it's ready to serve hot from the oven. You can simply serve them just the way they are. While they're still hot, you can pull out one wedge at a time while the cheese is clinging to it like this. I like to add a spoonful of sour cream on top, and a little bit of bacon bits and take the butter that's melted in the bottom of the muffin tin and add that too. I hope you've enjoyed today's video and I hope you give it a thumbs up and comment in the comment section. I look forward to hearing from you and until next time, happy eating!